Well, Aquame is the leading way to, of personalizing hydration. It's uh, a new company that with a the Aquame 2.0 smart water bottle and is raising money on the virtual platform to take it to the next level. It does have the backing of A-League football legend Archie Thompson and El um, Melbourne City FC's standout player Andrew Naboot, who have joined them on the journey as brand ambassadors and also directors. Steve G joins me from Aquame to tell us more about it. Steve, welcome to Startup Daily. I mean, Matt was talking about this at the top of the show. We forget to drink water. I've gone through my glass today, but I know I don't get through enough. Tell us a little bit about the Aquame bottle and how it works. So the Aquame water bottle helps you track your daily intake. You can set your daily hydration goals. As you drink from the bottle, the bottle smart chip records how much water has been taken from the bottle. It monitors it. So basically, you get on the app, you can track how much you have drank and how much you have reached your target. You can also set reminders of how much you want to drink and where you want to drink. or give you a free, uh, friendly reminder, basically tell you time to get hydrated. I mean, I do think it is one of those things that blokes do forget. And at the end of the day, we've had plenty of coffee and then a few beers and probably not enough hydration. Why does it matter, this problem? So hydration is a massive issue among consumers. So funny question is, most of us know how to get hydrated. So, but our, our most, the most common issue is we start to drink more when we feel dehydrated, when we feel thirsty. So that's a bad sign of it. So that's when the new bottle, Acrimi 2.0 comes in. That's like a hydration coach. It helps you hydrate. It works out when you need to hydrate, how much you need to drink pre-workout, -work, pre-exercise, and how much you need to drink post-exercise and post-workout. All right, tell us a little bit about this virtual campaign, Steve. What are you looking for and what does it mean to take Aquamay to the next level? So we're looking to raise up to half a million dollars on the virtual platform. So with that, with that import of funds, we'll be able to obviously upgrade the new app to more AI technology. So instead of you inputting the data yourself, the app itself will work out, read your reminders. It works a bit like the Tesla. So when you go to a gym, it reads the location service. It basically knows how long you spent time at the gym, how long you worked out. It gives you the correct amount of data that you need to hydrate in order to hydrate and recover correctly. All right. Um, and what's the feedback been like? You know, as a footy player, of course, you do need to keep your liquids up. What has Archie Thompson said to you? So... Archie, both Archie and Andrew came on board during this year. They helped a lot with the input data and obviously advices from a professional level. So they're basically advising what you need to hydrate, where you need to hydrate, and sort of the level and obviously other new features on the app. They've helped quite a lot. So from a normal consumer level, you're able to experience what the professionals need and help they get. All right, and um, do you have international ambitions for the product as well? So it was always on the cards when we started the company. So to expand to obviously the US, the UK, and even the Middle East markets. So to give you an idea how big the smart water bottle market is in the US, itself is $380 million cap market back in 2021. So if we're able to expand to the US later on this year or next year, it would be great for the company. Um, and if I want to get one now, I can't wait, aside from becoming an investor along the way, where will I find an Aquame bottle? So we've been approached, so ever since uh, June last year, we started our B2B model. So we were being approached by, the funny thing is, a farmers. So uh, a farmers called, a franchise called Mr. Vitamin. They've got six stores located in Sydney. Uh, I'll probably be rolling out in all their stores by end of this month.